Hold on to your hats, folks, because NVIDIA just dropped a bombshell at CES 2025, and it's clear they're not just playing in the tech sandbox anymore. They're building the entire playground. CEO Jensen Huang's presentation wasn't just a product launch. It was a manifesto for the future, an AI-powered future that's closer and more transformative than you might think. This wasn't just about faster graphics cards. This was about a fundamental shift in how we live, work, and interact with the world, all thanks to the accelerating power of artificial intelligence. This is the kind of presentation that makes you feel like you are witnessing a pivotal moment in tech history, the kind that will be looked back on as the start of something truly extraordinary. Huang wasted no time in highlighting the sheer magnitude of this transformation, pointing to a colossal $50 trillion segment of the global economy that's ripe for automation. Every industry, he emphasized, is in a race to digitalize, driven by the promise of increased efficiency, reduced waste, and enhanced productivity. And at the heart of this digital gold rush lies the burgeoning field of autonomous systems. Huang's prediction that self-driving cars will be the first multi-trillion dollar robotics industry wasn't hyperbole. It was a calculated assessment based on the sheer scale of the automotive market. Consider these numbers. 100 million cars are manufactured each year, a billion vehicles are already on the road, and a staggering trillion miles are driven annually. It's a market ripe for disruption, and NVIDIA is positioning itself as the key technology provider for this autonomous revolution. He believes that very soon these vehicles will be either highly or fully autonomous. The implications are profound, impacting not only how we commute, but also the design of our cities, the logistics of supply chains, and the very concept of car ownership. But let's not forget NVIDIA's core audience, gamers. The unveiling of the RTX Blackwell 50 series graphics cards was a showstopper, and for good reason. These aren't just iterative upgrades. They represent a generational leap in performance, powered by the groundbreaking Blackwell architecture. This new architecture boasts an astonishing 92 billion transistors and delivers a mind-boggling 4,000 tops, trillions of operations per second of dedicated AI processing power. To put this into perspective, Huang showcased a direct comparison that left the audience buzzing. The RTX 5070, which will retail for a surprisingly accessible $549, will match the performance of the previous generation's top-of-the-line RTX 4090, which launched at a hefty $1,599. For those who crave the ultimate in performance, the new flagship RTX 5090 will offer double the performance of the 4090, setting a new benchmark for high-end gaming and content creation. These performance gains are not merely the result of brute force, they're driven by the intelligent application of AI. Technologies like DLSS, deep learning supersampling, are being used to predict and generate not just individual pixels, but entire frames, effectively multiplying performance while reducing the computational load. This is a game changer, literally and figuratively. And it's not just about desktops. NVIDIA revealed that their laptop GPUs are also getting a massive boost thanks to these AI-powered advancements. This means we'll soon see incredibly powerful, yet thin and light gaming laptops that were previously the stuff of science fiction. The use of AI to generate pixels is a key factor in improving energy efficiency, paving the way for more powerful laptops with longer battery life. This is more than just faster frame rates. NVIDIA is fundamentally changing the economics of high-performance computing. By leveraging AI to enhance performance, they're making powerful GPUs more accessible, which will have ripple effects far beyond the gaming industry. This democratization of AI processing power will empower creators, researchers, and developers in countless fields but the presentation quickly transcended the realm of gaming, delving into NVIDIA's grander vision for AI. Huang articulated a compelling narrative about the evolution of AI, from its early days in perception, the ability to understand images, words, and sounds, to the current era of generative AI, which can create new content. But the next frontier, he declared, is physical AI. This is where things get truly exciting. Physical AI is about creating artificial intelligence that possesses a fundamental understanding of the physical world, just like humans do. It's about grasping concepts like gravity, friction, inertia, spatial relationships, and cause and effect. This intuitive understanding of how the world works is something we take for granted, but it's incredibly difficult to replicate in machines. To tackle this challenge, NVIDIA unveiled Cosmos, a groundbreaking world foundation model. Imagine a vast neural network trained on a colossal data set of 20 million hours of carefully curated video. This isn't just random footage, it's specifically chosen to focus on physical dynamics, 
human movement, object manipulation, natural phenomena, and the intricate dance of cause and effect in the real world. The goal of Cosmos is not to generate creative content like some AI models, but to give AI a deep, intuitive understanding of how the physical world operates. It's about building a foundation of knowledge that can then be applied to a wide range of tasks, from robotics to simulation, to even enhancing the capabilities of large language models. And here's the kicker. NVIDIA is releasing Cosmos as an open source project. This is a strategic masterstroke, mirroring Meta's approach with their Llama large language model. By opening up Cosmos to the global community of researchers and developers, NVIDIA is fostering collaboration and accelerating innovation in the field of physical AI. Cosmos is a potential watershed moment for AI development by providing a robust foundation for understanding the physical world. Want access to the absolute best AI models out there without the hassle of juggling multiple platforms? Let me introduce you to Chat LLM by Abacus AI, your all-in-one AI powerhouse. This incredible tool puts the latest and greatest models like O1, O1 Mini, GPT-40, and Claude Sonnet 3.5 right at your fingertips. Plus, it's got some seriously smart features. Root LLM automatically picks the best model for your prompt, and Search LLM scours the web for the most up-to-date info. Need your AI to sound less robotic? The Humanize feature lets you adjust the tone. And get this, you can generate stunning images using top-tier generators like Flux 1.1 Pro Ultra, Ideogram, and Recraft, and even create videos with just a prompt using powerful video models like Kling, Luma, Runway, and Hiluo. Coders, you'll love the artifacts feature for seamless app building. Plus, Creating documents and analyzing PDFs is a breeze. And for the ultimate customization, the AI engineer lets you build your own fine-tuned chatbots. It's all here. Ready to experience the future of AI in one platform? Sign up using the link below for your first month free. World. NVIDIA is paving the way for more capable and adaptable robots, more realistic simulations, and a deeper integration of AI into our physical environment. The decision to open source Cosmos is particularly significant, as it will undoubtedly catalyze research and development in this critical area. But how does Cosmos translate into real-world applications? Huang introduced a compelling framework that he calls the Three Computer System, which he believes will become the standard architecture for robotics development. 1. The Training Computer This is where the AI models are trained, using powerful systems like NVIDIA's DGX. This is where the heavy lifting of data processing and model optimization takes place. 2. The Deployment Computer This is the computer that resides within the robot or autonomous system itself, executing the trained AI models in real time. This could be the computer in a self-driving car, a factory robot, or even a humanoid robot. 3. The Digital Twin Computer This is where NVIDIA's Omniverse platform comes into play. The Digital Twin is a physically accurate, simulated replica of the real-world environment in which the robot will operate. By connecting Cosmos to Omniverse, NVIDIA has created what they call a physically grounded multiverse generator. This allows AI models to be trained and rigorously tested in incredibly realistic virtual scenarios before they ever encounter the real world. This three computer system is a blueprint for building robust and reliable robotic systems. Training AI in a physically accurate virtual world is crucial for ensuring safety and effectiveness, especially for applications like autonomous driving, where real world testing can be risky and expensive. The digital twin concept allows for rapid iteration, experimentation, and optimization in a safe and controlled environment. The presentation dedicated significant time to autonomous vehicles, a field where NVIDIA is already a major player. Huang declared that the AV revolution has finally arrived, thanks to the advancements made by companies like Waymo and Tesla. NVIDIA is deeply involved in this space, working with virtually every major car manufacturer, including established players like Mercedes and a newly announced partnership with Toyota, as well as EV innovators like BYD. To power these next-generation vehicles, NVIDIA unveiled Thor, their new computer designed specifically for autonomous driving. Thor is a processing powerhouse, boasting 20 times the performance of its predecessor, Orin, while also being production-ready. This means that the technology for advanced self-driving capabilities is not some distant dream, it's here now. The CEO also underscored NVIDIA's unwavering commitment to safety, announcing that their Drive OS is now the first software-defined, programmable AI computer to achieve ACIL-D certification, the highest standard for functional safety in the automotive industry. This is a critical milestone for gaining public trust and regulatory approval for self-driving technology. NVIDIA is also leveraging Omniverse and Cosmos to revolutionize the way self-driving cars are trained. 
They're using AI to automatically reconstruct real-world driving scenarios into detailed digital twins. This process effectively turns thousands of hours of real-world driving data into billions of miles of simulated experience, allowing AI models to be trained on a far wider range of scenarios than would be possible with real-world data alone. This synthetic data generation is crucial for training robust and reliable autonomous driving systems. NVIDIA's end-to-end -end approach, encompassing everything from training and simulation to in-vehicle hardware and safety certifications, positions them as a dominant force in the autonomous driving market. Their focus on generating vast amounts of physically accurate synthetic data is particularly noteworthy, as it addresses one of the key challenges in developing safe and reliable self-driving systems, the need for massive amounts of diverse training data. Beyond cars, NVIDIA is aggressively pushing for the widespread adoption of AI across all industries. They introduced NIMS, which are essentially prepackaged AI microservices. Think of them as building blocks that make it far easier to integrate AI capabilities into existing software applications and workflows. They also presented NEMO, a platform designed for onboarding, training, evaluating, and managing digital employees. These are AI agents that can be specialized to perform specific tasks within an organization, working alongside human employees. Imagine AI agents that can handle customer service inquiries, process invoices, or analyze market trends, all trained on your company's specific data and processes. This is where we start to see AI truly augmenting human capabilities, creating more efficient and productive workplaces. To further empower businesses, NVIDIA announced the Llama Neotron suite of open models. These are based on Meta's powerful Llama large language models, but have been meticulously fine-tuned by NVIDIA for enterprise use. They come in a variety of sizes, from small, ultra-fast models designed for quick interactions, to larger, more sophisticated teacher models that can be used to train and evaluate other AI agents. The CEO highlighted partnerships with major enterprise players like ServiceNow, SAP, Siemens, and Cadence, underscoring NVIDIA's commitment to making AI accessible across all sectors. They are targeting the estimated 30 million software engineers and 1 billion knowledge workers worldwide who will be using these tools. This is where NVIDIA's ecosystem strategy shines, by providing businesses with the tools, platforms, and resources they need to easily integrate AI. NVIDIA is accelerating the adoption of AI across the board. This creates a virtuous cycle of innovation, as more businesses using AI leads to more data, better models, and even more sophisticated applications. The focus on open models like Llama Neotron is particularly important, as it democratizes access to powerful AI tools and fosters a collaborative environment for development. NVIDIA's vision isn't limited to large enterprises and research labs. They're also bringing the power of AI directly to individual users. They're working to make Windows PCs a first-class platform for AI development by leveraging Windows WSL2, Windows subsystem for Linux. WSL2 allows developers to run Linux environments directly on Windows, and crucially, it already supports CUDA, NVIDIA's parallel computing platform. This means that developers can run and train AI models directly on their Windows PCs, effectively transforming them into powerful AI workstations. This is a significant step towards democratizing AI development, making it more accessible to a wider range of users. Also, the fact that NVIDIA AI will work with Windows opens them up to hundreds of millions of users. And then came the mic drop moment, the unveiling of Project Digits. This is a compact yet incredibly powerful AI supercomputer designed for personal use. It's a sleek, beautifully designed machine powered by a new top-secret chip called GB110, which is the smallest implementation of their Grace Blackwell architecture to date. Project Digits is essentially a personal AI workstation, or even a mini-cloud supercomputer that can sit on your desk. It runs NVIDIA's entire AI software stack, giving individual developers, researchers, and even hobbyists access to a level of AI processing power that was previously unimaginable outside of large organizations. The CEO showed how these could be connected together to form even more powerful computing clusters. Project Digits is a bold move that could have a profound impact on the AI landscape. By putting this kind of computing power in the hands of individuals, NVIDIA is fueling a new wave of innovation from the ground up. This could lead to breakthroughs in fields we haven't even conceived of yet. Driven by the creativity and ingenuity of individual developers and researchers, the presentation culminated in a powerful vision for the future of robotics. Huang declared that the ChatGPT moment for general robotics is imminent, 
a pivotal point where advancements in AI will converge to create truly capable and adaptable robots. He outlined three key areas of focus. 1. Agentic AI. These are AI agents that can perform tasks and make decisions in the digital world, like the digital employees powered by Nemo. 2. Self-driving cars. An area where NVIDIA is already heavily invested, as we've discussed. 3. Humanoid robots. This is perhaps the most ambitious and exciting area, and NVIDIA is positioning itself to be a major player. To accelerate the development of general-purpose robotics, NVIDIA introduced Isaac Groot, a comprehensive technology platform providing developers with essential tools, libraries, and resources. This platform, combined with Cosmos and Omniverse, provides a powerful toolkit for building the next generation of robots. In conclusion, NVIDIA's CES 2025 presentation was far more than just a product launch. It was a defining moment for the AI industry, a bold declaration of intent from a company that's not just riding the wave of AI innovation, but actively shaping its trajectory. NVIDIA is building the foundational technologies, platforms, and ecosystems that will power the next era of computing, an era defined by intelligent machines, autonomous systems, and a seamless integration of AI into our daily lives. The message is clear. The AI revolution is not on the horizon. It's here, it's accelerating, and it's going to change everything. The sheer breadth and depth of NVIDIA's vision, coupled with their relentless execution, make it hard to bet against them. They are not just predicting the future, they are actively building it.